Biotechnology in the Philippines has always been a very challenging field. Biotechnology development starts with research. And if the landscape is still a challenge at this point, then the biotechnology industry will have difficulty flying off the ground. But I think it's changing and it's evolving. We see more young scientists consider research as a career. Biotechnology has a lot of implications. It's actually a driver of economic growth. And uh, investments in research R&D is a very strong uh, component in improving the industry in the country. No? The driver or our motivation is the diseases of poverty. No? Diseases of poverty demands the attention of every individual, including scientists. No? Our team said, how can we harness the power of molecular-based technology without the huge amount of expense attached to it. Hence, we decided to do it on our own, here. And when you have the technology that can identify the disease at such early stage, the, uh, the timing of intervention can be life-saving. The Biotech M Dengue Aqua Kit is designed in such a way that uh, it's very simple where in kaiting dika molecular uh, biologist you can perform the test this innovation is actually uh, designed for people to have access to the technology all the way to the marginalized sector we are actually being encouraged for scientists to be entrepreneurs as well and I think part of the problem is the skill set needed you know, or the drive to go into that area. We created the Manila Health Tech Incorporated as the first startup coming from the University of the Philippines. Kami sa Manila Health Tech, we are partnering with the local government units, hospitals, institutions so that they could level up the healthcare delivery that they are giving their patients. We believe that the ultimate goal is to achieve behavioral changes in the health-seeking behavior of our patients and the delivery system of our healthcare sector in general. It may appear like a cliche, but we really love this country. And as scientists, we want to make sure that we make a difference in the best way we can. We cannot be engineers, we cannot be actors, we cannot be politicians, but we can definitely be scientists and innovators. And that's the role we're willing to play to help our country become a better one in terms of health technology development.